Well, lesson today from coming from the Hamptons, which is about, what is it? About two hours train ride from New York. So the Hamptons is where the Kennedys used to come for their weekends. It's where a lot of the rich New York come for their holiday homes to come and stay. And basically just come to, come to their holiday homes. And houses range anywhere from about a million, which is like real bottom end, up to, from what I can see, 25 million. So we're about a kilometre from the beach here, but on the beach, I'll just show you this property here. On the beach, um, on the beach, they're worth like 15 to 25 million. And it seems to me, once you get past six or seven million for these houses, um, every extra million uh, is not really, you do not need the extra house you need. They've got like eight bedrooms, eight bathrooms, and often it's two people living in it. So to bring this back to marketing, the question is, you know, where do I find my ideal customers? Well, you know, if you're, if you're an architect or, or an accountant or, a, I don't know, an insurance person or a, anyone and you're targeting high-end clients, this would be an example of a place where it would be a great place to, well, I mean, this is where the fish swim, right? They come from New York, they come here on holiday and they own these houses. This is a very small house that we're staying in. Um, but these, these other houses, I'll get some images because they're just phenomenally, uh, almost obscene, um, the size of these places as we get towards the beach, the $25 million jobs. So, you know, it's an example of, you know, this is where the, <laughs> this is where the fish swim, depending on what your market is. But certainly, certainly the rich New York fish swim around here. Um, so that, that's the kind of thing for you is, is, you know, if you are targeting the top, um, the top, you know, the top one to five percent of your market, they do tend to behave in certain predictable ways. They do tend to have holiday homes in certain locations. Like they don't have the holiday home ten kilometres that way, which is kind of um, very uh, modest. We just had dinner out there for twenty dollars, a couple of bits of pizza, and a couple of drinks and things like that. And people were saying, "What are you doing here?" Because it's off the beaten track. Um, they hang around over here. So the fish, you know, the, these high-end type clients do act in predictable ways. And it's kind of what you've got to think. Now, you know, they may not live and have their holiday homes in a certain place, depending on the target market you're after. But um, if it's a good target market, it, it will have some sort of predictable behavior that you can kind of identify. What clubs do they belong to? What magazines do they read? Do they have holiday homes in certain locations? Do they join certain clubs? Right, uh, these are the type of questions you've got to ask yourself, and if if they don't do any other than that, it may not be a good niche, right? Because you just you know there's no point fishing if you can't identify where the fish are. You've got to be kind of able to to you know find out where they are. So sometimes it takes a bit of work, and sometimes you know the type of fish you're trying to attract never swim in the same place. You want fish that swim in one little area, and they all swim together, kind of like this. If the type of fish you're trying to reach have no predictable behaviours, it might be a niche that's not worth chasing because it's just too hard to catch them. So that's the thought for the day. That's the question, where do I go to catch my fish? Well, you know, I don't know, depending on the fish you're trying to catch, but these are the type of questions you've got to ask. So from the Hamptons, off to the US Open tomorrow, which is about 20, 20 minutes. Uh, this, is, this is West Hampton. And the US Open, apparently, well, the practice rounds start tomorrow um, in Southampton. So we're going to go along and look at the, uh, have a look at that. We just, because we're here. Why wouldn't you? It's, it's where the fish swim. So it'll be another education. Uh, probably worthy of a video tomorrow. See you then. Cheers.